Oh, my f I'm very good friends with Anastasia Victory, who does the music, and Michael Mitchell. They're friends of mine. I've known Anastasia since 2009, when we were baby performers. She was the MD for The Wiz that I did in La Jolla with Des Mackinoff and Sergio Trujillo. And so I've known her since then. And so she called me one day, and she was just like, um, I'm doing this project, and I think that you're this character. Like, I don't know, and we're just doing a cold reading of it. We've never read it before. No one's ever read it. At this point, we've never had any actors in the room. And she invited me in for a cold read. Um, we were at the, um, we were in New York City and we were in a studio and I got the script the night before. And I've been working in this time period for a while. Um, I was in the film that just came out recently, Bolden, um, which was about Buddy Bolden. And, um, and then we, they did a short film um, in conjunction, a short silent film called Lewis, which was about Lewis as a young man, um, watching Buddy Bolden and being inspired by, you know, the jazz musicians of that time. And so this is a time period that I've been working in about 10 years now. And so when she called me and she, you know, sent, they sent the script over, I sat down that night and I read it and I just, I felt like I had just been transported into what I had been working on for so long. Um, and I read this character, this Daisy Parker, and I was just like, oh, I love her so much, you know, like she's so colorful um, and she's so layered and and I was very excited about it. So I immediately started studying the script. I think I got the script at like 10 p.m. that night. I started studying the script. I started studying just in the time that I had the reading was the next day. And I stayed up all night and I was like oh, studying the script, studying this character, trying to understand what they're trying to do with the show. And so I went in for the cold read. And, you know, cold reads are hard, <laughs> you know, because you don't really know the material. Um, but because I stayed up and I was really invested and I, I already knew so much about the time period, it just started to this this character started to kind of pour out of me in a way that felt real and right for me, at least in the moment. And it was after the reading when Christopher and um, Oren, they were like, so what are you doing in July? Like, are you available? Are you like around? And I told Anastasia, I was like, I don't care what's happening in my life. I don't care what other projects are going on. I don't care if I fly away and come back. I need to be attached to this project. Um, Cause it's very rare that you find a project with strong female characters like this. Um, especially when we're, usually when you have a male centric character like a Lewis, so much of the story is about him and we don't really find out about the other people in his life. So to tell the story from the perspective of the wise really shot, uh, puts a light on him as a hero, but also as just a human with flaws. And I think sometimes when we're telling stories about men, we paint them in this hero light and we forget that they're people too. And it can be both. They can have character flaws and we can still love them. And I think that having the wives involved in the story really allow us to have him be a person, but also we still love him even though he's flawed. Um, and so I, that was how I got introduced to the world of the show. And then from there, it was just like developing this character. And, and once you get invited into this type of process, at least for me, it's like, I don't want to be released. So it's important that I like really invest a lot of energy into developing the character. We're doing readings at this point, so they're not expecting us to be off book. But my background as a dancer, I've been a dance captain in almost every show that I've been in on Broadway. Um, I've been the associate choreographer on several shows, so my mind works in a way that picks up material quickly. And so I was able to learn the script. So even though we're in a reading, I was off book. So then I was able to play. I was eventually able to like introduce some like physical world of the character, which I really think like showed itself to Chris and Oren that I was a good person to bring along for the project.